Welcome to Coronavirus Wednesday. I'm going to be doing something a little different today. So stay tuned. You know, when you're unemployed, you have no future, bills to pay, what do you do? I'll show you. Alrighty. This is my neighbor's house, and this is his wife's leaf-filled 17 Scout. And what I'm going to do today on this boat for him... Transducer. Um, put a new bracket on here for a new hummingbird right there. He bought a new hummingbird. Didn't like the little one that was on there. So this is all the bits and pieces and all this. All I have to worry about basically is the bracketry and the transducer and the transducer mount. That's what I'll be doing in this little boat. And pulling off the old transducer right there. So, that's today's project here on Coronavirus Wednesday.
there, maintenance junkies. In the wolf den here, just uh, doing a little video editing. As you saw, that was a little job that I did for my neighbor. I tried to speed it along and add some really cool music. And uh, I'm gonna put this out there for subscribers, basically. Aura Walk, that's Gary. That's Gary from Long Island, the guy that's been so helpful to me with my Suzuki maintenance. As you can see, the whiteboard behind me, it's got all my maintenance stuff on there, dates and everything that I've changed, oils and, and water pumps and, and all. That's how important it is for me. Gary said in the last video, my most recent video, in a comment, but the problem is people are sitting on these things and not reading comments. But 99.9% .9 of everybody's using one of these and they're not reading comments. Gary's name on YouTube is Oral Walk and he comments on every single video. And he offered that when I do a video, and I don't know how else to do this. Uh, I really don't know how else to do it on YouTube. But he offered, like on a maintenance video or even this video, if you've got sort of a technical outboard question. Now granted, he can't put himself standing at your outboard. Okay? Same thing he can't do for me. But if you're kind of battling an issue, he's an outboard mechanic, okay? That's what he does. But if you're having an issue, he put wanted me to put it out there that on a maintenance video or something of mine, if you will give it a like, if you will give my video a like, because I can get 450 views, but I'll get... 22 likes if you can give it a like but if you're one of the usual crew let's say that comment on my videos and you have an issue or something that you're needing to know about without calling a mechanic or whatever, and you want to ask a mechanic a question either way we're going to see if this works I told Gary I would put it out there that if you have a question he'll answer try to answer it for you. Maybe you can banter with him on emails. I don't know. But ask Oral Walk a question. He'll put his comment up there. Go right under his comment and say, hey, Oral Walk, I'm having an issue with my engine stalling. I try to be like Scotty Kilmer. I watch Scotty Kilmer. He's an auto mechanic. And he teaches you little things to look for to do things yourself and save money. That's the big deal for me. If you got a little issue and you want to ask them, address your comment below my video to Oral Walk. That's the, sort of the best we can do to do any kind of banter. It will help my videos if you give it a thumbs up. And he said, well, I want to do it with your subscribers. I don't know who everybody is, if everybody's a subscriber or not. It's hard to go in and, I mean, I can go in and look at my subscriber list, but I mean, I got, what, you know, 9,500 subscribers? I don't know. But I just wanted to put it out there that he wants to help you. And at the same time, help my videos by giving it a thumbs up. If you haven't seen it lately, I sit and I watch all the briefings, if I can, of things going on. President Trump and uh, Vice President Pence want to, or I guess pretty much, have an idea that they would like to have this closing of restaurants, closing of things like that, end at least around Easter. I know I need it. And these Democrats holding back stimulus or a way for me to get a loan to pay my bills, possibly to, and then have low to no interest, or that $3,000 for a family of four or whatever. I mean, 
anything right now will help me because I my my future right now is so uncertain. After 24 years, I thought the depression in 08, 09, it really hit me by 09, 2009. I thought that was bad. Well, and I'm sure many of you are in the same boat as me. We're all in the same boat. That's the problem. I mean, there's a lot of people that are still working, of course, but then there's a whole lot of us that aren't. I don't know how fast people are going to spring back from this, even if things get opened up and kind of go back to normal. I really don't know. It's just so uncertain. I've never been through anything like this. We've all never been through anything like this. It's a fact. It's happened. What can you say? I don't even know what to say. Even if they opened up the airlines tomorrow, even if they opened up restaurants and this and stuff tomorrow, I don't truly believe it's going to help me at all. I don't know. So that's it. Thanks for watching. And uh, this was Coronavirus Wednesday. Another day. I don't know. Sitting around the house, got nothing to do.